Now to a disturbing discovery in Wake County police finding human remains in Cary while investigating an illegal trash fire. Tamara Scott is live there with the latest. Tamara, what have we learned here? Well, good afternoon. Yes, I'm here still on scene. Cary police still have this home blocked off behind me. We are learning that there was a body found inside of a homemade fire pit early Sunday morning. Now, I did speak with neighbors very briefly this morning who told me they did see some weird activity from their neighbors Saturday night and then early Sunday morning. They smelt the fire and they said it was a very horrible smell. That's when police made their way out here. And since then, police had been on scene investigating for more than 24 hours. They just recently left the scene, but earlier we saw them investigating throughout the house as well. But a lot of questions for the neighbors who live in this area. We came out here for an outside fire. There's a burn pile, tons of cardboard. It looks like there's a body in the pile. There's lots of homeowners going back in the camper. I don't know what's going on. Now, these are the moments that Cary police officers realized their call for an illegal fire turned into a death investigation. Within that initial investigation, Cary police found the homeowner inside a parked RV on the property with a self-inflicted gunshot wound. We know that he has life-threatening injuries. A woman was also found on the property but was not injured and is talking with police. Now, Cary police say the homeowner was renovating the home and was burning trash related to the demo. Investigators also shared the homeowner lived in an RV while the home was undergoing those renovations. Now, we do know that police have not given us much information about who that person was inside the fire. The metal exam medical examiner has come in to take the remains and are working on that process. We don't know anything else about that process at this time, but we will bring you the latest information as soon as we know that. Back to you.